What's up guys, your boy Alex Benz here and I'm gonna compare two popular sizes and style of chains. It's a four millimeter uh, rope chain and a four millimeter Miami Cuban. I'm gonna just get right into it with the close up. So I'm gonna show what it looks like with a pendant in the shirt look, what are they called? What do they call it behind the, behind the neck look? Yeah, I'm gonna get into all that in a second. Stay tuned and usually I post more frequently but I've been going through like a lot of school, a lot of work, hustling on the side. A lot of new stuff coming, I swear. Stay tuned. All right, I'm gonna show you the clips right now. Hi everybody, so we're back again. And uh, yeah, if you're debating on which one to get, like I said, so you have like a like a price range on a rope chain or a Cuban link, $1,500 price range. I think it's what they go for, I think, I'm pretty sure. And if you're trying to decide on what, if I had to tell you my man or my lady or whatever, whoever you are watching me, and the, and the, the thing I have in front of us that you're interested in, it's really a matter of, do you want more of a flashy, thicker presence rope chain? that everyone's gonna look at, or this nice tight link, everyone knows that, but the Cuban link, the nice tight link, classy, just clean gold chain look, it's really up to you. This is definitely more recognizable because everyone knows a rope chain. And then this is more like, more of a keen eye, keen eye, lately becoming more popular, but this is definitely more like noticeable. So four millimeter rope, four millimeter Miami Cuban, it's up to you, what do you think? If they'd have a like pendant on it, you tell me, would you like? Would you wear this every day? For me personally, this is nice sometimes, but I couldn't really wear that every day because I wouldn't want like a such a thick, flashy rope chain like that all the time. Even though well, there's a five millimeter, fourteen karat diamond rope chain coming, twenty two inches is coming, man. Stay tuned, it's coming for real. Got some stuff on the way for the channel for y'all to see for reference, anything like that. My brother's coming up, you know. Anyway, so yeah, or. Do you want to wear the Miami Cuban link with a pendant like this? And that Jacoji, that Jacoji guy, shout out to him and everything. Of course, everyone everyone has respect for him. But he said the Cuban link don't look good with pendant. I beg to differ, man. This they look good. It looks great with a pendant. I don't know why he says that. There's like a little, little twist or something at that bottom. Man, you don't even notice that when you're when you're wearing it, and people don't notice it either. Not that you know they did. Who cares? Anyway, yeah. So it's really up to you. Would you want to wear more of a classy, clean link gold chain like the Cuban link? or the more flashy, thicker presence rope chain. It's up to you, man, or lady, whoever is watching. It's really a matter of you, man, presence. If I, again, if I had to sum it up, rope chain is definitely more standout-ish and flashy due to the diamond cut and the thickness. And this is a more like classy, clean gold chain look. Yeah, so yeah, stay tuned. I'm gonna do some better clips of it. And yeah, like, comment, subscribe. Some stuff on the way, I don't even wanna say. My man, anyway, I show a little clip of one little small thing I'm gonna grab as well. Already done, but I have some stuff in the woodworks coming from the Diamond District in New York. Believe me. Anyway, so take care, everybody. Let me know what you think, good or bad. Good or bad. And yeah, check in with me, everybody. Stay tuned. I hope y'all are doing good and getting to your goals. Like, comment, subscribe. I don't know if a billion times I said that. And yeah, salute. Take care.